Hey, I hope you're all doing well. Um, so, we just played The Clash. We got Chambers Bay an awful lot. And a lot of you were saying in the uh, in the comments that you really struggle on the 13 greens. Um, let's go and show you how that can work. Um, this one's got high winds as well, so we, we should hopefully get uh, a few tricky putts. I won't be able to control it the way you can on now uh, in low winds. Uh, and that is not a great wind to start with, is it? Uh, 21 headwind. Um, but it is what it is. Uh, it's not like we can't reach this. So, 136 times 21 over uh, about 175. This is going to play about 153. Um, or maybe 154. Uh, Uh, plus the elevation, 157, 157. Um, it should be about that. I'd rather miss this right than left. Feeds in from that. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. We'll take that. Allows us to get uh, off potentially a bit of a banana skin hole hitting a medium iron in there. Um, so this one, I mean, my, my tip is just to make sure you don't give this a chance to turn away. Just hit it firmly in the middle of the hole. Um, don't be sort of dribbling those that can that can start to turn. I know a lot of you are missing missing because of the uh, the dive at the end. Oh, I need to be a bit careful here. It looks like Kevin's got us off um, off the hard tees rather than the, the champs. I suppose it replicates the uh, the extra distance from the apparel and clash. But it is going to bring into play stuff that I'm not used to being in play. So I'm just going to have to pay attention. So twenty times one three seven over one uh, one eighty. It never plays as much wind as you'd think. This one. Um, what's that gonna do? That is gonna be about. I think it's going to play about 129 overall, um, maybe nearer 130. Rather be a little bit short than a little bit long. Um, about six to the left. That should be good. Oh, what's wrong with that? I hope this isn't long. Please don't be long. Long is. Desperately difficult. Well, that um, that's okay. I'm mean, slightly short, um, and if you can, slightly left is the uh, the place to miss this. Now this is a weird putt. Um, I had this a few times in the clash, and I missed it uh, the first couple of times to the left. Um, you can see that it wants to break. I mean, it lo looks like there's a break there. Um, the thing is, when you're hitting it as hard as I'm about to here, um, I mean, 11.1 plus the, um, plus the 4.9, it's 16 times 8 over, and the green speed's going to play about 10 and a half up that hill. Um, and that gets you up to 12. I mean, you're going to be hitting this. I'm going to whack this about 13. And just take the break out of it. Um, boom. Yeah, there you go. Um, it's so easy to have that either dive across the hole at the end or um, as I was doing in the clash just staying straight and just, just missing on the left and you're kind of sitting there scratching your head going what's going on um, oh, is this a, we're off the four T I think we might still be able to reach this which is good um so certainly not going to have a problem stopping it. 
coming into a wind like that, which is, is normally the problem. You don't want a, an awkward tailwind here where you having to hit sort of a half a driver. That, um, that's you, just a, really difficult to stop it. Um, so we'll go for maximum distance and hope for the best. Well, the heart beats, that's always a good start. Yeah, oh, that's sweet. That was right below the hole. Um, that's almost a dead straight putt. That's perfect. So again, we just need to whack it. Um, it's going to be almost straight. It wants to go slightly left to right at the start. Um, a little bit right to left at the end. I'm just going to give this a good whack. It's into the wind as well. Unless she blows. It's a big, big chance, that hole. If I sound a little bit gruff, it's because I've actually got COVID. That's uh, why I've got time to do things like, um, like YouTube videos today. Can't go out, can't do anything. Um, but yeah, if I sound a little bit gruff, that is, uh, that is why. I'm fine, don't, uh, don't, don't need to worry, but... Um, now this one, uh, it's going to want to run on. Always wants to run on, and you can't let it get over that ridge. You leave yourself a diabolical putt. Um, so I'm going to take a little bit off this. I'd rather be, if I miss it short in the bank and it doesn't get up, it's, it's not the end of the world. I can make that putt. Um, if I run sort of 15 feet past, you don't want to make that. Uh, most of the time, you're not going to make that. I want to hit about one three nine. Got the heartbeat. It's got a good line. It's got a great line. A great line. Okay, we get a tap in. See that rolled on six yards there. Um, just need to be careful with that one. I've seen them shoot on sort of, particularly when you're hitting a long iron in there. I've seen those shoot on sort of 14, 15 uh, yards. Get the wrong bounce and away you go. Um, so just whack this one away and um, roll on the second shot. This one, so it's good. Take off a couple for the uh, the downside. Never quite seems to play the full the full elevation on this one. Um, there's also a slope behind the hole and to the right of the hole to sort of spin it back towards the can. So uh, I prefer to work slightly on the side of being long and right here. Um, not too much. It's a really difficult putt if you get stuck up there, but. Um, Right, that felt nice. That one felt nice. So right below the hole again. Uh, this one's not uh, trivial though. So it's it's uphill. Um, Seven point four. So it's gonna play. Um, and watch out here. That you can see the break is. Uh, and is in the same direction as the wind. The wind is going to want to exacerbate that break. Um, it happens in heavy winds. You do need to factor it in. Um, because it's so much up a hill, I'm just going to give this a mighty smack. Um, a little off.
often as well. Um, perfect. Just whack it through the break. Uh, it was never going to go more than three foot past if I missed that. Uh, and this is a lovely win. Look at that. It's dead, dead straight tail. Um, dead straight, maybe a little bit. It's a little bit left to right on that. Um, Anyway, I think I want to hit this about one five three, and um, I prefer off the tee ball, not not playing full backspin into some of these holes where it can rip, um, rip crazy. It shouldn't downwind like that, but um, I am a little bit left to right. Just it just seems like it's it's going to want to push it that way. Okay, no surprise. We got the ding. No surprise to get the heartbeat there. Um, hopefully this is really good. Oh, where's that going? It went exactly where we aimed it. Must have been a dead straight tail. Um, damn. I seem to go left to where we aimed it. Um, okay, same same story as the last. Wind and uh, break in the same direction. A little bit downhill as well this time. So it is going to break a bit more. We have to be careful. Um... I'm going to give this a whack again, because um, I'm like that. Oh, we missed. I thought I might have missed that, you know. Uh, missed dinged to the... Um, missed ding slightly early. I was pref trying to miss ding slightly late, believe it or not. Um, I got away with that. It snuck in the left-hand corner. Okay, nice distance. Um, without wind, it's not going to be coming in with too much spin. I don't think I need to adjust the, uh, the spin. That's um, it's a slight tailwind, but I'd, I'm not going to play anything for the uh, the distance on that wind. I think it's going round in enough of a circle that that's going to offset. Uh, the extra distance is going to offset the slight tail. Um, so we're going to hit about 55. That's looking sweet. Yeah, we'll take that one. It's a menace of a green, this one, so uh, it's always nice. And um, believe it or not, you do need to pay attention to this one. Um, I'm, I'm going to whack it again. I'm going to hit far too hard, but uh, it won't go over the hole. Just stops it breaking. Ugh, yuck. Um, on 13s, you don't want to see left to right wins here. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Um, anything about three yards right goes in the bunker. That's a uh, reason for me being a little bit cautious about that. Is that a forty-five degree wind? I mean, it looks like it's a little bit more of a, a little bit more of a headwind than a tail, right? Um, straight forty-five degree would be about twenty-four yards. Um, I think it's going to be nearer to sort of twenty-six or so, heading twenty-two across. Uh, almost a full three. I just take a little bit off. Perfect. We hit. Whoa! 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 whoa. No heartbeat, and it's gone in the bunker. Missed ding that slightly. Ah, oh, I can't believe that. I just caught that bank that rolled in the bunker. We're off by about twenty percent on the um the wind calc there. So I'm I'm not entirely convinced I can reach with this. Um it's better than the other option that's gonna run on. I think we play no spin and just hope it that I should be able to get within a couple of feet with this. Ooh, oh, it landed about it landed about a quarter of a foot short on the top of that hill and killed it. Um, never mind. This is a, it's a straightforward putt. Uh, we just need <coughs> just need to hit this one. J 
just needs to be hit. You can see going into the wind as well. Again, it's the wind in a similar direction to the um, to the break. So um, yeah, I should give it a little bit more, a little bit more, maybe off ding this a little bit as well. Yeah, I should do. That was disappointing. I thought that was a great tee shot, and um, well, you saw the result. It wasn't. Ah. That was a difficult win. I think that's ruined our chances of making uh, making the eagle. Can't reach. That's a good bounce, man. Um, no, we can't. It's not worth it. Um, to I mean that's gonna play about about two sixty. Um, I can reach the brush in front of the green um, quite comfortably. I don't think it's going to hop through that and into um, into position. Um, believe it or not, that stuff that looks like fairways uh, it classes it as brush. Um, you've got it. You've really got your work cut out to make uh, make the birdie if you go in that. So whack it over. Yeah, I mean that that would have been the brush. I think. Um, had we gone for that. Please have. I've learned my lesson the hard way on those. Uh, that's quite a nice distance for just a full backspin pitch here. Oh, I think that's just missed. Yeah, it's 0.4 feet. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Um, oh, well. Pretty tight around though, nine under in, uh, in heavy winds and 13s, I'm, I'm happy with that, Chambers. Um, I mean, 17, 17 was disappointing, we were unfortunate there, I think we may have found a line camera angle actually. And nine, um, yeah, we just got a crappy wind off the tee, didn't we? I couldn't reach it. Um, average distance to pins tight, uh, but to behold a one, got to be happy with that on uh, 13s in heavy wind. Um, didn't really hit the ding very often, but to the side, to the left-hand side this time. Um, anyway, thanks for watching.